Ladies and gentlemen, this is Keith from iRepair Autos. Today I'm going to show you how to take your cigarette lighter ashtray holder compartment apart, take it out, fix it, clean it, check the uh, connections on the cigarette lighter. We also call them auxiliary ports. How to get them to close, stay closed, and what happens and what to do when they don't want to close all the way. Um, new video every Monday, like, share, subscribe. I really appreciate the comments and the questions down below, so don't be afraid to ask questions and send feedback. Let's get started. Looking at the interior of your Mercedes, climate control modules, and down below is your, we call them cigarette um, tray and immediately you see coins in here very bad thing to do you shove this close a coin may flip up come out go behind and keep this compartment from closing properly if you can't open the cigarette lighter holder it's because it's jammed and it won't come out any closer than that we can still access the bolts by popping off the front face and to pop off the front face, what I'm going to do is pop that cover off just like that. Taking a Torx 20, we're going to remove two screws. I'll show you where those two screws are. So with the ashtray open, you'll see a screw right there on the right side. And you'll also see a screw on the left side. Pardon all the crumbs and everything else. We're going to get all that cleaned up. We're going to start by taking these screws out. That's the left side. Then once it's uh, unscrewed, bring them apart like this. And before bringing it out all the way, attempt to close it. If yours doesn't close, then be extremely careful when pulling it out. Closing it like this prevents the screws from flying out and getting lost. Once it's out, you can then Flip it over, disconnect the power like that, and we can completely remove it. Here are my screws right there, one on that side and one on the left side. Oftentimes this little gear mechanism, there's a spring here, often gets put into the wrong position. If it's in the wrong position, this will not open. Okay, so the pin is just about off. So that you can make the adjustment. Pop it out. Hold that there. Now that it's adjusted, we can push the pin back into place. And then we're gonna attempt to close it. And while we're closing it, we're also checking to see if it'll open. That's the right position right there. Once it's in position, we will then take the plastic holder retaining clip and we're going to slide it through that's him so remember this pin this pin right here with the spring loaded with the retainer clip and this gear mechanism can get out of alignment I showed you how to take out the pin how to align it next thing to do at this point is to put back on the door shiny piece at the bottom goes into these two grooves right here one that's that slid into place next thing we're going to do is we're going to take our screws that we took out 
I like to just drop them into put into place. Second side. Screws are in, close it. That way they can't fall out. Pay close attention not to lose your screws when you're sliding it in. That's why I like to leave it closed. Push it in, open it. Using the Torx 20. As always everyone don't forget to like share subscribe to my channel if you find these videos helpful what that does it pushes my videos up in the search results so that other Mercedes owners drivers do-it-yourselfers can find them easier thanks and peace out